Surprise Bob so challenged that so early. That too. <laughs> and that too. And that too. And that too. Alright, so first game of the second video, we've got Roldiz and Jared. I don't really know who Jared is, but obviously Roldiz just qualified for uh, RLCS Season 8 with his team. What a pinch of that. Should be a pretty good chance. Let's squishy go for this. Then I spent the, uh, the misses from both of them, so wasn't really positioned for that. And it should be a shot. Nice. So what I did there is, uh, once I was air dribbling and got in the way, I just tried to back myself off right here. So that way it, he hits it into me and then it pops off backboard. There's very little chance that Jared's gonna be ready in net for whatever backboard hit happens here. There we go. Just wanted to stay relevant on that ball. I don't want to just back out for boost when they could, uh, pressure me. See a little of my boost. That was a pretty bad touch though. Oh no, I wanted to pinch that so bad. I love those pinches across field. Even if it doesn't go in, it's still satisfying. Oh, I tried to shoot it behind him. Should have shot um, a little bit closer off the corner. Should be able to take some time here. Jared's pretty far. Close. Good 50-50 on the first one. Uh, Roldez ended up getting ahead of me on the second touch, which is fine. Still gets rid of one player. Should be Squishy's ball here. Really good control. There we go. Almost. I ended up faking it a little bit because he went up the backboard. Uh, which gives them a really bad chance of getting a good touch when I bring the ball low. There we go. Back to me maybe. Oh, nice finish. Really good drift turn. All I had to do was just force the 50-50 since roll days went. Uh, once Jared threw that ball away, it was pretty free for me to take some control. And uh, it was good of me to get a pretty decent 50-50 off of the uh, the challenge. And we're able to get some possession. Didn't get the boost, which kind of sucks, but should be able to just recover on this and get behind. What a pinch. <laughs> oh my. Backboard. Rolled is going to touch, which is fine. Just try to get around him on this and then maybe make a play in mid. Should go back to Squishy. Nice demo by him as well on the back end. Putting in some work when we don't even see it. I'll let him challenge first. Sort of what Squishy likes to do in, in twos is uh, be the first to challenge. And then have someone back him up. I didn't expect, quite expect him to turn on that. But you know, we're okay though. Still backing him up. That's okay that he challenged that. Maybe pop it up. Squishy's in the net. <laughs> so I'm just going to pop it around. See what Jared does. Pretty free possession. Good flick. It's going to be challenged by Roldiz. So I'm not going to push in too hard for this. It's 50-50. It's probably going to be Jared again since that turn is by Squishy. I missed the boost. That's good. I knew he was going to bump me. Ouch. <laughs> good follow by Squishy too off the off the recovery. That was funny. Shouldn't have let Roldiz uh, bully me like that. Really good follow up. He's starting to pick up the pace a little bit. I just gotta recognize that. Nice, good 50 50. Just try to bait and roll this a little bit. Oof. That's gonna be a free goal. A little bit of a fake by Squishy, a little fake action, and we get the win. Not too bad. Um, definitely warmed up now from the first video. I uh, hope you guys are enjoying these games. I don't really uh, play much 
uh, ranked on my channel anymore, actually. Uh, sometimes I do some rank ass games, but I just try to keep it fresh and original every every uh, every video, just because I don't know. I like to make sure you guys are entertained. I don't know if ranked is the most interesting thing. I like playing with Squishy and other pros because uh, we get to make some more passing plays and it's a little more structured. All right, so for the second game of the video, we have Bobsto and Frantic Cartoon. I haven't heard of either of these guys. Should be an interesting match. Oh, back pass, pinch. <laughs> it's a little bit, bit of an awkward turn by me. I didn't expect the, the corner bounce off that touch. I was hoping we could try to make a pinch or something. But a decent play by the opponents. Make sure it's a, a really awkward touch to make a save, so it gives it right back to Squishy. Give me some respect here. Can't really follow up on the next touch. Should be some free possession though. Oh, go for the demo. Nice block. Make sure I get the bump on him, then that way Squishy has some free room here to work with. Close. Couldn't really pass it mid off that touch. That was really awkward. Just had to wait for uh, whatever they were going to do on the challenge. So far this play is really, really awkward. Just really early challenges. Make sure I get the beat on him. Just go down the corner. Kind of threw the ball away. They're really low on boost. There we go. Should be a play. See if I can make it happen. Oof. Close. I have nothing here. This could be really bad. Don't want to overcommit. Even though we're, at, we're down a goal, it's not a big deal. We've got lots of time to work with. Like right here. See if Squishy can make a play, maybe. Close. Yeah, that's why I just waited, because he was going to give me the ball. Oof. That was clean. Made a little bit of a... A little bit of a stall, and then landed with the ball and chipped it at the last second. It was just enough to make him question what I was going to do on, on defense. bit of misdirection it goes a long way like I said you just want to make sure you're not you're not easily read like readable by your your opponent and uh, to be the best teammate you want to be hard to read for the opponents but easy to read for your teammates <laughs> I'm just gonna let them barrel that challenge get the one kill on them good shot applies some good pressure Ouch. Pinch? Oh, sorry. I was going to try and pinch with that. I don't think he expected it. Nice. Nice blocks. Popped it around him, but it's going to bait Squishy in there. I don't think he uh, quite expected the the opponent to turn around on that, on that shot. In that situation, it's way too close to the defense. Probably need to back off and back. We have most of the pressure this game though, so should be able to get a goal here. Not too worried about him challenging that. He was low low boost off kickoff. Should be able to follow up. Pretty bad touch by that guy. Surprise Bob so challenged that so early. That too. <laughs> and that too. And that too. And that too. That's how twos is though. You gotta just expect people to challenge immediately. Make sure I pop it up really awkward. Probably should just wait for the defense there instead of jumping for the backboard like Squishy did, but... It's okay, we should be able to just still keep pressure here. And this should be a shot on target here. Okay, Bob still went really, really early. That's fine. 
pretty good shot on target, but we could make a play out of defense. Try to bump him. Didn't really work out, but Squishy should have free free possession here. Nice bump. There it is. <laughs> the classic, the classic air drill bump. You don't, you don't get too many opportunities in threes, but uh, in two v two and one v one, you definitely get some space in the field to make a bump like that. And they aren't the easiest thing to pull off. Let's be real. Might be fast enough. Yeah, he didn't expect the pinch. I guess the opponents aren't too happy with uh, their attempt on the save on that one. Oh, that's pretty bad. Uh oh. Yeah, we don't uh, we don't take those. <laughs> Unfortunate by Squishy there. Not the best kick off by me. Tried to keep it close to the ground, but their kickoff seems to be really slow. Should be a, a touchback. Gonna pop it over the one. Well, under me, but that's fine. Squish should be able to get back in time. Nice double. Alright, Bob's is up for some reason. And it's a goal. There it is. <laughs> Really good shot by Squishy. I'm not sure why Bobsto was jumping for this. They're just trying to, they're like, I don't know what they're doing. They're just like trying to get in the way of everything. Which can work in twos for a while until we just recognize it. And then uh, we just take our time with our shots. Oh my. Except when that happens. <clears throat> I just don't know why I cheat with Squishy's kickoffs as well. I always tell myself I should go back corner. And yet I'm going to do it again because uh, that's how I roll. Should be Squishy's possession here. I'm not going to try and touch that. Go for the air bump again. Here it is. And <laughs> and there's the wall again. I hate those those plays. Because they're like basically impossible to stop. There it is. <laughs> we got Squatchy versus Squishy. This is quite the quite the matchup here. Let's see how it turns out. Oh, almost. Try to get a good uh, fake off that dribble. Oh my god, what a miss too by that guy. <laughs> totally threw Squishy off. I think Squishy was going for the block on him. And he just didn't get, get on target with his touch. There we go. Should be open. And there we go. Not bad. So I recovered for my uh, mistake in mid from last time. Uh, that guy challenged pretty aggressively. Gave us a lot of openings. I should have used that chance to do a, a pinch. I don't know what I'm doing. Pinch? Oh no. He's coming in now. Ah. Don't question it. Pushy was waiting for a pass, but it just wasn't really possible at the angle I was going at. Oh, my bad. And he missed. Should be a shot. Nice. That was really awkward. I thought Squishy was going to rotate behind me when that ball came to the side. Should have just realized he wanted it. And I just back out. Just hard without communication. Because I've got like full boost there. I can make a play. And I slowed down because I saw him come in. It happens. That's why communication for me is like super important. I basically require it at a competitive level. Because I just assume the best. Which isn't always the best thing. Just because I always like, I always see what's possible. Oh. oh I put that around squishy. Oops. A bit awkward. It works out though. Got the demo on him as well. I'm probably going to shoot it. What a chip and a finish. Nice. Yeah, but what I was saying is I always like, I always see what's possible. Like I, if I see someone beating someone, I'll go for it. Like for a position where uh, 
I can follow up on the next touch. But if someone on my team like slows down or something, it's hard to like weigh that into consideration unless someone communicates that they're like waiting or something. I mean that's just that's just how the game works though. If he gets in the way of this, it's fine. Just take some control. Okay, never mind. This guy's going speedy mode. Nice flick. Once again, this these touches aren't that dangerous. Just gonna let him touch it. I can't double. Oh, no. It's unlucky. I should have definitely followed it up a little better. Oh, no. <laughs> I tried to steal it. But not too bad so far. Really good chip. We just done, we've done that like twice now where we just chip it across as they're trying to challenge because they're behind the play. And uh, since they're just pushing into it and they're not recognizing that they're being beat, we can just put, pop it around them and uh, get a free opening. Sort of like that. Oof. Maybe a turn? What the heck was that touch? He's gonna follow it early, which is fine. And I just stuffed that guy. I'm a little tank. What? Bro, there's so many things that were wrong with that. Like right here, on this air on this right here, it like pushed my car down. And I did not fly up that high. There's no way. Alright, I actually went back corner this time. Surprise, surprise. Back to Squishy. Oh no. I'll put him. <laughs> and that somehow still worked. I didn't expect the musty flick attempt, that's for sure. I was like, oh yeah, I'm gonna go for this. And then I backed him out. Oh, that's nice. Oh, he had it out already.